What is going on, everybody? It is the Misfit Bear, and welcome back to another reaction. So I know I talked about doing the the three random horror videos, you know, reactions, and you know, there were some people that gave some positive feedback to that. So we're gonna actually uh test that out right here, right now, by watching. Let's see, I I, I didn't have this shit planned ahead of time. So it's more back rooms, okay? It is first contact and missing persons, which is what we saw at the end of the found footage. There were the those were the two um videos that you could click on. But for the third one, we're going to do the informational video as well. So the first one's only two minutes. The next one's two and a half. The last one is eight. So we're going to get some good spooks into this. Uh, turn the volume up because we definitely going to have to immerse with this atmosphere that these videos bring in. Let's get right on into it. Yeah, I remember seeing those a lot on the VHSs. <laughs> Never gets old, man. Test number six. What is going on here? Modifications. Okay, hold on. Triple support beam on internal chamber 23A. Introduced plus 13 additional RF cavities. Introduced, redacted, into the redacted. Replaced detectors 41 through 90. High precision beam now monitors for, vibra for vibrations exceeding 90,000. I don't know what that is. Millivolts? I, I don't know. What is all this for, man? Who is in here banging? Or is that something walking? Ooh, that is something walking. It's that freaking thing uh, that you had to fight in Resident Evil Village. What the? What the hell is that? What is happening? Bro! What the hell? It's a map? Is that a map? Are we finna play freaking Pac-Man? So the back rooms are like an alternate dimension and they forced their way through? Something like that? I swear to the almighty, if you run around that corner, yeah, that is what it seems like, huh? That like the back rooms is an alternate dimension and it's trying to spread into the real world. I don't know, but uh, that was pretty good. So let's move on to the next video. Missing Nicholas Bolton. Is that the guy that was in the first one that fell? Oh, a lot of people. Margaret Watson. You ain't even got a name. With your Waldo looking self. That's probably why. Ellis White. You were only two? Man. Janice Scott. Reported missing persons cases. Well, there was a spike. Uh towards the beginning of the 90s and after 1990 it just what yeah i think the back rooms are trying to like take over yo and they're in it how do you get out oh y'all have a rope so what y'all can just pull your way out 
or just you in the front. Oh my gosh, this is so interesting. But I'm gonna try not to talk too much. I'm just excited. Okay. Whatever they're holding on to, that thing is never ending. Oh, is that that freaking robot? What I say, C three PO's crackhead brother? Oh boy! <laughs> what are y'all doing? No, that is a whole person. That is a whole person. This wasn't in the last report. Yo, why does the wall kind of? Why is the blood on the wall, if that's even blood, painted to kind of look like a horned helmet, though? That's actually kind of dope. It's, it's organic. Or like a demon. It's some kind of fungus. Fungus? Whoa! What did that say? So that one was missing persons. I guess they're in the back rooms trying to find people? I have absolutely no idea and, and i'll try to come up with some witty thing to put in between um videos to kind of spice it up a little bit i was thinking of that whenever i said let's move on to the next one but let's move on to the last video informational video for internal use only async you keep popping up welcome to the project tv 30 i was finished start reading team in this short, informative video, okay. you will be briefed on the required protocol in regard to Project KV-31, as SCPs, well as receive right? an overview of future development plans. Yep, SCP Foundation. What is Project KV-31? Project KV-31 pertains to the study and development of the Async Low Proximity Magnetic Distortion System. Huh? Threshold. That's where For that door was. You By may the look hear of it, peers refer the to back the room under any of the following titles: the machine, the door, the Whoops. back rooms, the complex, hallways. Interesting. Unauthorized usage of these terms outside of the async research facility is strictly prohibited. The threshold what? guided supervision. What? What about the other regulations? You ain't just never enter the complex alone. You ain't just finna do that to All me. Expeditions are to be comprised of no fewer no than less three than three individuals. February 29th, 1990. What is that freaking leap year? Ain't that leap year? You cross the threshold. Can they walk back out? Because if that's the case, then where's the danger? You can, you have a guaranteed exit. Or is it the concept you got to make it back to the exit? And the place is a freaking maze. Oh, I guess that's why they have the red, the red tape. So they can know the direction they came. I mean, do you really think that they're actually... I wish I could hear what y'all are saying. There's that damn black suitcase again. Okay, so we're just going back over uh, what happened towards the towards the other one, right? Towards the second one, because we're walking with the same people by the look of it. Um, I hear that hear too. This? Yeah. Is it the back rooms trying to trick you? Hey guys, can you hear this? Hey. Oh, you are screwed. Oh. You are screwed, Guys. my friend! 
Good. Open. You shouldn't have split off from the group, my boy. Oh. Don't you know? You never split the party. <laughs> For my D and D, my fellow D and D players, if you know, you know. And sorry if I'm hitting the mic. I'm trying to get it close enough to my mouth to where my voice doesn't trail off like it does. Oh, oh, what's that? Is that that fungus? Man, where did y'all go to do this at? Wow. I'm just listening for robot noises. What is that? Uh-oh, -uh, boy. I was waiting for him to turn around. You all right? Did you walk a long way to finally find your way back? All I gotta say is, you better muster what energy you got left and run. How high is this ceiling? Boy, you better keep moving. Uh-uh. Oh, uh-uh. Uh-uh. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. Go ahead, I'm ready. Nothing? All right. But I'm watching you, though. I'm watching you. You better pick that up right now. You better pick it up right now. You gonna need it. Pick it up. No, stop turning so fast. Did you pick up the ax? Always have a weapon. Where even are you? What the hell was that? What are you? What, what were you doing? You were just standing there. So you didn't make it out. Okay. I had some high hopes for you. Do these places just lead into different locations? Is that what this is? Yeah, you lost. You hella lost. Thankfully, you don't have a big ass robot chasing you. I don't know, I might have spoke too soon. I don't know, man. I don't like, I don't like why that concession stand is there. Then again, it could benefit you, bruh. Because you're probably tired. You're probably thirsty. Is it not opening? Oh, it opened. Move in. Is this a sigh of relief? Or what is this? Hello? Oh, no, he's nowhere. <laughs> Intruder alert! Intruder alert! <laughs> what happened to him? What happened to him? I want to know what happened to him. Man. I guess that's them trying to map it out. Complex. Okay. Well, alrighty, guys. That was the first 
quote unquote installment of three scary videos. Uh, what the hell is this? The smile tapes? Nah, we gonna have a bonus video. Hold up. Bro, look at this thumbnail. How could I say no? This message is broadcasted to raise awareness of a new drug in circulation. A new the drug? drug. Y'all ain't slick, okay? Drug. We advise for you to stay away from any person suspected to be under its influence. Right. For the past few months, 500 we have received over 500 deaths related to the drug. Dear God! The drug itself has not been scientifically It's like the Joker toxin! Its most obvious effects are mania, uncontrollable laughter, violent tendencies, and the latch smile <gasps> of the drug was- Walking up the street and you see that? Bro, don't come anywhere near me or I'm gonna go to jail. It's an island which the drug was named after. Oh, great. How do you ensure your safety outside? Stay uh, packing! Dark alleys since most reported deaths happened near or in the dark alley. If you hear suspicious laughter, run as fast as you can. Start busting! Avoid eye contact with the person. Once the person notices you, it will begin pursuit. Start busting! Interact. You will most likely be- Not me! Not me! I stay with the strap on the lap, okay? Smile Investigation Journal, issue number one. Oh my god, this is freaky. Initial observation. Substance is made of spores from an unidentified species of fungus. Oh, it's The Last of Us 2. Or Last of Us in general. Risk of accidental intake is very high. Accidental? Oh, great. Patient one and patient two. Brought to the emergency room on the same day. Complaining of a severe headache and acute facial cramps. None of the medicine helped. They were taken to the laboratory for observation. Stage one, week one. Oh, it's going to progress. Yeah, look at that. Patients begin to smile with some resistance. Fight the good fight. <laughs> Patient suffered meningitis before subsiding within two days. Patients remain sane. What we looking like now, Doc? Oh my god, any resistance have been subdued by the fungus. Faces begin to contort to a wide grin. That dude on the right is feeling it. Patience's behavior becomes predatory. Can you imagine if they just start biting you? Manic laughter begins. I'm shooting. The patients were then locked in a room? No food, no water, no nothing? Week four, we skipped a week.
What the hell? Bro. Bro, that is a state beyond death. Holy shit. This is only five minutes in. Fungus has permanently damaged facial tissue. Leaving a severely contorted face. Despite extensive nerve damage, they continue to smile. Yep, the fused muscles maintain its expression. If ever the patients recover, a face transplant is required for reintegration. Vocal cords have stopped functioning due to extreme strain. Ouch! Patients' behavior and motor functions begin to decline. Towards the later part of this stage... What? What? Week 5. One week later. Rapid senescence visible in patient... Patient! Did you see that? Patient has completely lost resemblance from past self. You look like a fallout ghoul. You heard me? You look like a fallout ghoul. I could see the side of your jawline. Your hair receded terribly and the other dude died. Okay, he kicked the bucket. Brain is in the late Alzheimer's stages. Wow. Patient 2 did not live up to this stage. Can you imagine going through that, let alone watching it? Patient one passed away six weeks into his admission. Autopsy. Okay. Fungus found in brain cells. It was observed secreting a substance similar to what? Acet uh, uh, acetylcholine? Acet acetylcholine. That's what it sounds like. High concentrations of the fungus found in Ami um, what? Of uh amygdala. Suggesting complete control over it. Oh wait, the Meduta Oblongot? No, maybe not. 30 minutes into the autopsy. I don't know this stuff. A sudden burst of gas came out of the patient's mouth? What was initially thought to be gas, it was more of the fungus. We figured to be the spores of the fungus. Two morticians were present in the room. They may have inhaled the spores. They have been quarantined. Oh, man. Sean G. Excerpt. December... 431? What? Hold on. I went out for groceries. I'm not worried about it. And this strange man threw flour at me on my way home? I was more weirded out than I was pissed. Anyways, I'm taking Max to the vet tomorrow. He's been quiet for days. And I'm worried. Log 28. December 5th, 94. I had this vivid dream where I was flying through space. It's like I became one with the universe. Then I saw a man. And I woke up. Him. Nah, fam. <laughs> nah, fam. December 6th. Max has been feeling better. Well, that's good. He began to bark again. Oh, look at Maxie boy. I feel relieved. I had a very similar dream to yesterday. I flew through a colorful space. I forgot who I was. Then I saw him. He smiled. I'm gonna have to make that, that fungus 
make a zombie or a skeleton based on that fungus in D&D. <laughs> oh yeah. I've been having the same dream for the past week. And it's kind of worrying me now. Does this mean something? A change in my life? I couldn't stop thinking about it all day. Wait, hold on. You're not going to slip that by me. You are not going to know what was that? Those were numbers. What were those? My face won't stop twitching. Oh, he's infected, and I'm having a migraine right now. This may be my worst one so far. Did he get the shit from the dream? It could just be stress, so I told my professor I can't attend for this week. Yeah, he got infected somewhere. It's been four days since the migraines and twitches began. I am in agony. I will go to the doctor. Log 40. Okay, we're keeping the days consecutive, I believe. They told me it was just stress and electrolyte imbalance. Just take pain meds and relax. With this being a thing, though, and stay hydrated. With this being a thing, though, why would they not know the symptoms? My face hurts. It feels like someone is pulling the sides of my mouth up. It's getting harder to blink. The pills don't work. Oh, we skipped ahead a few days. Max passed away. I don't understand. He was doing just fine yesterday. Oh, did you lash out and kill him? Like, choke him out? We skipped ahead a few more days. My friends say that I look a lot happier recently. Oh, this is Christmas Day. I am not. <clears throat> Behind this forced smile, I am suffering. I cannot imagine going through that, man both physical and mental anguish. Doctors were stumped by my illness. Oh, was he the first one? Was he the first one? He might have been the first one. I am happy. I feel full of energy. I felt the man's aura. He changed me. For the better. I don't know, man. I am happy. I am happy. So, so happy. Oh! It, will you hold up now? You're not gonna move faster than me? He told me something. A quest to fulfill. A band. New life. Oh, so a quest to fulfill a brand new life. He told me something. A quest to fulfill a brand new life in a better place. Oh, it's nearing a New Year's. World's too unbearable for a simple man like me. Too much vice. Too much sadness. But I have the power to fix this. World's to him. Yeah. December 31st, New Year's Eve. Everyone shall become happy. I hope I make you happy. What's going to happen? Did you hear missiles being launched? Yo, what the hell? Time and date, 1201. Location 718, Ventura Plaza. Name, Sean Gomez. Age, 22. Incident, 
Mass homicide. Details. Perpetrator was armed with a knife. He had a grotesque facial expression, suspected of being under influence of some drug. Police response. Police officers were not able to subdue the man. He wounded one of the officers and committed relentless violence. The officers were forced to shoot him dead. Aftermath. 17 casualties, including Sean. 10 injuries. Hold on, I just heard something knock somewhere. Maybe like one of the neighbors shifted or something. Hold on. Okay, 17 casualties, including Sean, 10 injuries. So that kind of caught me off guard, like something did actually happen. Do I look beautiful? Do you have like a car of, I'm in a happier place now. Do you have like a carved in smile? He smiles. Okay. Yeah, that was worth it. That was worth it. <laughs> now, I hope you guys enjoyed these three random horror videos plus one. If you did, why not leave the video a like? Let me know what you think down in the comments below. And if you haven't already, why not consider subscribing? Hit that notification bell so you don't miss any more of this mayhem. Until next time, I appreciate all of you for watching. Like and subscribe for more, for I will continue to make these videos for many moons. Stay safe out there, and never forget to holla at your bear. Peace out.